Oh my goodness, I can actually see myself on camera. I have a brand new video camera that actually works. Here's my old one. You open it up, you can turn it on, and you're supposed to be able to see what you're going to film. However, for the past, what, six months, that's all I see. So I have no idea what I'm actually filming. I have no idea if this can be fixed or not. But now I basically have a similar model that I can see. Yay! I can see myself, just like you can all see me. So we're going to film a video today. What a concept, huh? What is today? It is Saturday, December 10th, 2022. And I don't have my Christmas tree up yet. But we might do it this weekend. I want to talk about something. I don't know if I've talked about this before. I probably have. The banning of one-time use plastic shopping bags. In theory, it's a great concept. However, there are other plastics that are still in use that actually make up a lot more plastic than the bags. I want to give credit to where it's due. I'm trying to remember if it was CBC Zach Gowdy who did a story on this a while back and said, sorry if it's not you Zach, but somebody on CBC did, they, I don't know where they got the information, they said most plastic waste actually does not come from the bags you get at the grocery store, but it's the plastic wrapping that comes on each product. Let me show you what I bought yesterday. As you know, I collect hockey cards, and this is a package of eight sheets of card holders, I guess we'll call them. Sheets that will hold nine cards, and you can put them neatly into a binder. And guess what? There's a plastic cover on this, so I'm going to open it here. See this now? There's, I don't have a knife, so I'm just going to use my toothpick here. There we go. Up we go. Aren't they beautiful? Binder sheets, I can put my cards in them. I don't just have to store them in a box. I can actually put them in here, they'll be safe. I can thumb through them and enjoy my cards, <clears throat> which I will do. And in some cases, I'm gonna be selling some cards. So you hockey fans out there, keep an eye on my site because there's gonna be some hockey cards up for sale. And now what do we do with this? This is one-time use plastic, will never be used again. And it's not really something I can reuse. We're going to fold it up like this. And we're going to throw it in the garbage. Right? Yes. Now help me do the math. 8 times 9. That's 72. I can put 72 cards into these. But guess what? I have a lot more than that. I actually have thousands of cards I want to put in binders. So we bought a whole bunch of these which means we're going to have a whole bunch of these. This is the problem, folks. It's not the plastic bag you put this in at the grocery store. It's this itself. And there's way too much of this stuff. You go to the grocery store, you go to any store, you're going to buy a product. Most of the time, it's going to be sealed in something like this. The video camera came in a box that had the parts in plastic as well. Um, you buy a jump drive, it is sealed in plastic and then it's cardboarded and it's hung up on a shelf, right? You buy a Sharpie marker, it's got plastic and it's got the covering and again it's hanging on a shelf somewhere. Even this little roll of dental floss came in a plastic cover that was probably four times as big as this, right? These hair elastic thingies, whatever you call them, that help you keep your ponytail. I think they came in a plastic container. I honestly can't remember. Batteries. Look at this. They're covered in plastic. See what I'm trying to get at here?
it's nice that we're trying to do things to reduce plastic use, but I question whether we are targeting the right areas. This ban on single-use plastic shopping bags is more fluff than substance. There it is! I said it! It's a political ploy, and it's not actually solving the problem. Just thought y'all wanted to know. Look at those Kansas City Chief t-shirts in the background. Aren't they lovely? <laughs> Big game tomorrow. Denver, you're going to have a rough day. <laughs> Thanks for watching my video, everyone.